Hi, my name is Jana Lauritsen. I'm 54 years old, believe it or not. Yes, there's no denying. <laughs> um, I uh, have been in the computer world for more than 20 years. Uh, I have a lot of experience with computers, PCs, all that good stuff. I was business liaison, blah, 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 blah. I know you're very interested in that, but I'm just going to get to the point here, okay? So I'm going to just uh, give a brief description of how you defrag a disk and what that means, okay? So you've heard that term, I guess, to make your computer faster. Have you defragged your disk? Have you defragmented it? Well, what the heck does that mean? Okay, so let me just explain. In the area, uh, in your computer, there's an area called the hard drive. Everyone knows this. It's also referred to as disk. Um, when programs are running and you're writing updates, they put the updates anywhere they can in this disk. Oh, does it fit in here? Yes. Oh, does it fit in here? Yes, I'll write it there. I'll write it here. I'll write it there. Same program. Let's say it's Facebook or something. Facebook here, here, here. Well, wait a minute. So to get my name, I gotta go here. To get my address, I gotta go here. Well, eventually, this is gonna take a long time. There's a lot of access going on here. I have to go here, I have to go these different places. So what happens? It makes your computer slow, very slow. So when you defragment it, or defrag, if you will, the computer puts all these pieces back together in a cohesive pattern in one spot. So here's all your Facebook data, let's say, when you come back in after you've done the defrag. So this helps your computer go faster because it just has to go here to get the data then. Not here, 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 and here, and there, and there, and everywhere. So that's why defragmenting is good for your disk. It makes it faster. Ta-da! Thank you.